In nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Intro ivo ad altari Dei. Uticum e Deus et decerne causa meum de gente non sancta, abomine iniquo et aloso eroe me. Emite lucem tuam et veritatem tuam ipsum e de duxerunt, et a duxerunt in montum sanctum tuam et in tabernacola tua. Confitebor tibi incitera Deus Deus, meus quale tristis es anima mea, quale conturbas mea. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Intro vivo ad altari Dei. Adjutorium nostrum in nomine Domini. Confiter Deo, omnipotenti Beate Maria Sempre Virgini, Beate Michele Arcangelo, Beate Iwani Baptiste, Sanctis Apostolis Petro et Paolo, Omnibus Sanctis et Nobis Fratres, Quia Peccabinimis Cogitazione Verbo et Opere. Mea culpa, mea culpa, mea maxima culpa. Ibio prepor Beato Marim Sempre Virginum, Beato Michele Arcangelo, Beato Iwani Baptiste, Santos Apostolos Petro et Paolo, Omne Santos et Vos Fratres, Orare per Mea Dominum Deo Nostrum. Misericordia vestri omnipotens Deus et demisis peccatis vestris, per ducat vos ad vita eterna. Indulgentiam absolutionem et remissionem peccatorum nostrum, triduat nobis omnipotens et misericordiae dominus. Deus, tu conversus vivicabis nos. O stende nobis domine misericordiam tuam. Domine exaudi orationem meam. Dominus Fobiscum. Leitabitor Justus in Domino, et speravit in eo, et laudabuntur omnes recti corde. Xaldi Deus orationam meam cum deprecor, a timore inimici eripe anima meam. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicud erat in principio et nunc et semper et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Leitabitur Justus in Domino, et speravit in eo, et laudabuntur omnes recti corde. Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Christe eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Gloria in excelsis Deo, et in terra pax omnibus bonae voluntatis. Laudamus te, benedicimus te, adoramus te, glorificamus te. Gratias agimus tibi propter maniam gloriam tuam. Domine Deus, rex celestis, Deus pater omnipotens. Domine Filii Unigenite, Iesu Christe, Domine Deus, Agnus Dei, Filius Patris, qui tolis peccato mundi miserere nobis, qui tolis peccato mundi suscipe de precazionem nostram, qui sedes ad exterum Patris miserere nobis. Moniam tu solus sanctus, tu solus Dominus, tu solus Altissimus, Iesu Christe, cum Sancto Spiritu in gloria Dei Patris. Amen. Dominus Fobiscum. Oremus. Leitator Ecclesia Tua Deus, Beati Agapiti, Martyris Tui, Confisa Suffragiis, Atque Eus Precibus Gloriosis, Et Devota Permaniat, Et Secura Consistat, Per Dominum Nostrum, Iesum Christum Filium Tuum, Qui Tecum Vivet et Regnat, In Unitate Spiritus Sancti Deus, Per Omnia Secula Seculorum. Lexio Epistolae, Beati Pali Apostoli ad Timotium. Carissime, 
Memor esto, Dominum Jesum Christum resurrexisse a mortuis ex semine David, secundum evangelium meum, in quo laboro usque ad vincula, quasi male operans, sed verbum de inon est alligatum, idio omnia sustinio propter electos, ut et ipsi salutem consequantor, que est in Christo Jesu, cum gloria cele celesti, tu altum assecutus es meam doctrinam, institutionem propositum fidem, longanimitatem, directionem patientiam, persecutiones passiones, qualia mihi facta sunt Antiochiae, Iconii et Listris, quales persecutiones sustinui, et ex omnibus eripuit me dominus, et omnes qui pie volunt vivere in Christo Jesu persecutionem patientor. Justus cum ceciderit non collidator, quia Dominus supponit manum suam, tota die miser miserator et comodat, et semeneus in benedizione erit. Alleluia, alleluia, qui sequitor me non abolant in tenebris, sed habebit lumen vitae eternae, alleluia. Dominus Fobiscum. Sequentia Santi Evangelii Secundum Ioanne. In illo tempore, dixit Iesu discipulis suis, Amen, Amen, dico vobis, nisi granum frumenti cadens in terram, mortuum fuerit, ipsum solum manet, et si alte mortuum fuerit, multum fructum affert. Qui amat animam suam perde deam, et qui odit animam suam in hoc mundo, in vitam eternam custodi deam. Si quis mihi ministrat me sequator, et ubi sum ego, illic et minister meus erit. Si quis mihi ministraverit, honorificavit eum pater meus. Mass this morning is being offered for the repose of the soul of Francis Granville. Eternal rest granted to him, O Lord. May he rest in peace. May, I'm sorry, it's a she. May she rest in peace. May her soul and all the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Maria Mater, our prayer for vocations. O God, we earnestly beseech thee to bless the church with many priests, brothers, and sisters who will love thee with their whole strength, be faithful to their vocation, and gladly spend their entire lives to teach thy truths, serve thy church, and to make thee known and loved. Bless our families, bless our children. O Mary, Queen of the clergy, pray for us. Pray for our priests, seminarians, and religious. Obtain for us many more, amen. Maria Mater Ecclesiae et Domine Fatime. A lesson from the epistle of blessed Paul the Apostle to Timothy. Dearly beloved, be mindful that the Lord Jesus Christ is risen again from the dead, of the seed of David according to my gospel, wherein I labor even unto bands as an evildoer. But the word of God is not bound, therefore I endure all things for the sake of the elect, that they also may obtain the salvation which is in Christ Jesus with heavenly glory. But thou hast fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, faith, long-suffering, love, patience, persecutions, afflictions, 
such as came upon me at Antioch, at Iconium, and at Lystra, what persecutions I endured, and out of them all the Lord delivered me, and all that will live godly in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecution. A lesson from a continuation of the Holy Gospel according to St. John. At that time, Jesus said to his disciples, Amen, amen, I say to you, unless the grain of wheat falling into the ground die, itself remaineth alone. But if it die, it bringeth forth much fruit. He that loveth his life shall lose it, and he that hateth his life in this world keepeth it unto life eternal. If any man minister to me, let him follow me, and where I am, there also shall my minister be. If any minister to me, if any man minister to me, him will my father honor. Thus far the words of the Holy Gospel. Today is the feast of Saint Agapitus, martyr. He was martyred at Praneste, Palestrina near Rome, where from ancient times he was greatly venerated. There, Pope Felix III, who died in 492, built a church in his honor. We know from ancient inscriptions as well as from the Collect and his Mass what great confidence was placed in his intercession. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, Amen. We have in our hall a statue of St. Agapitus over on that side near the windows. And years ago, when uh, we were just starting up, some of our men went over to Philadelphia and they had churched, closed a few churches and came back with a truckload of statues and uh, that big painting that's in there on the wall and the hall came with it. And I said, where are we gonna put all this stuff? And they said, we'll find a place. So they did. And one of those statues was of St. Agapitus who I had never heard of. I didn't know who he was. And he doesn't have much of a story to tell because we don't know much about him, but that we, all we do know is that there was great veneration. And if you look at the missal, you'll notice sometimes where a saint will just have the three prayers and you go to the common of, of confessors or martyrs or whatever. St. Agapito has his whole mass written out in the missal. So that, that's a sign right there that his cultus or those who loved him go way back in history and they never moved that out of the missal. Now, of course, in the pre-55 missal and way before that, this was the octave of the Assumption and St. Agapitus would only been uh, commemorated but we don't do the octave anymore, but I try to do a spiritual octave, which I'll say something about in a second. But I, I, I want to commemorate, I want to say his mass today, number one, because he is a martyr, because of these magnificent readings that teach us about persecution, which we're all going to see more and more of from within and without the church. Uh, it's happening everywhere. The other day there was a horrible article, I don't know where it was printed, I think in the Atlantic, about how the rosary has been weaponized by conservatives and traditionalists and it's become a violent symbol. And it said, since when has the rosary been associated with fighting and victory? Well, I, I'm sorry, but go back to Lepanto, go all through the popes and what they said. So this guy wants to link violence and hatred with the rosary. And there was a Catholic uh, so-called theologian from Villanova, whose name is Massimo Fagioli, which means uh, Max Beans is his name. Max Beans wrote that this is true. So this stuff is coming out more and more. It's amazing to me that how the venom is coming out. When somebody's down, a lot more people will jump in to kick them. The church is down right now, and so everybody's jumping on. And we have to be ready for that. Um, and, and I think it's time for us to now carry the rosary out in public and say it in public. I, I say it often in public and I've never had anything bad happen yet, but you don't know. So I think that's something to think about. And it's those little martyrdoms that help build up the church because people will see our courage. Uh, either they'll think we're crazy fanatics or they'll see our courage. And um, you can't convince those who think we're fanatics because they've already bought in to the ether of the day and they've swallowed the Kool-Aid and there's nothing we can do about it but pray for them. On the other side, we have the, the, uh, we have the um, 
octave of the, of the Assumption, so I've kept the frontal on and the flowers in front of Our Lady. Uh, as a spiritual octave to remember that great feast day. Uh, she, is our, she is our intercessor right next to the throne of her son. She is our mother, she loves us, she wants us to be with her son forever. She is one of our greatest uh, helpers in this life and we want to honor her here at Mater with all our heart, soul, mind, and strength because she watches over and protects this place so very beautifully. So we ask Our Lady of the Assumption, Maria Sunta Ancelum, to pray for us and help us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, amen. Oremus. Possuisti Domine, in capite eus coronam de lapide precioso, vitam peci itate, et tribuisti ei. Alleluia. Per omnia secula seculorum, Amen. Dominus Fobiscum, Sorsum Corda, Gratia Sagamus Domino Deo Nostro, Veridignum et Nustum Est, Equum et Salutare, Nos Tibi Semper et Ubique Gratia Sagere, Domine Sancte Pater Omnipotens Eterne Deus, Per Christum Dominum Nostrum, 
perque maestatum tuam laudant angeli, adorant dominationes tremon potestates, celi celerumque virtutes acqueata seraphim, socia exultatione concelebrant, con vivos et nostras voces, ut admiti uveas de precamor, supplici confessione dicentes, Sanctus, 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 Dominus Deus Sabaoth, Pleni sunt celi et terra gloria tua, Hosanna in excelsis. Benedictus qui venit in nomine Domini, Hosanna in excelsis.
nobis quoque peccatoribus. Per omnia secula seculorum, oremus, recepti salutaribus moniti, et divina institutione formati, aldemus dicere, pater noster, qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra. Pane nostrum quotidianum da nobis hodie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, <coughs> Et ne nos inducas in tentatione. Per omnia secula seculorum, pax domini sit semper vobiscum. Agnus Dei qui tolis peccatomundi miserere nobis. Agnus Dei qui tolis peccatomundi miserere nobis. Agnus Dei qui tolis peccatomundi dona nobis pacem. Domine non sum dignus. Domine non sum dignus. Domine non sum dignus. Ecce agnus Dei, ecce qui toli peccato mundi, Domine non sum dignus, sur interes et pecto mea, sed tantum ic verbo et senavit or anima mea. Domine non sum dignus, sur interes et pecto mea, sed tantum ic verbo et senavit or anima mea. Domine non sum dignus, sur interes et pecto mea, 
Qui mihi ministrat me sequator, et ubi sumego illic et minister meus erit. Dominus sovescum. Orremus. Satiasti domine familiam tua muneni vos sacris, eos quesumus semper interventione nostre fove, Cuyo solemnia celebramus, per dominum nostrum Jesum Christum filium tuum, qui tecum vivere et regnat in unitate Spiritus Sancti Deus, per omnia secula seculorum. Amen.
Dominus Sobiscum. Ite Isa Est. Benedicat vos omnipotens Deus, Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sanctus, Amen. Dominus Obiscum, Initium Sancti Evangelii Secundum Ioannem, in principio erat verbum, et verbum erat apodeum, et Deus erat verbum, hoc erat in principio apodeum, omnia per ipsum facto sunt, et sine ipsum factum est nihil quod factum est, in ipso vita erat, et vita erat lux hominum, et lux in tenebris lucet, et tenebre ea non comprehendero. Uit homo visus adeo, cui nomen erat Ioane, sic venit in testimonium, ut testimonium per hiberet illumine, ut omnes credorem per illum, non erat ille lux sedul testimonium per hiberet illumine. Erat lux vera, quae illuminat omnem hominem venientum in hunc mundum. In mundo erat, et mundus per ipsum factus est, et mundus eum non coniobit. Impropria venit, et sui eum non receperunt. Quod, quod, autem receperunt eum, dedi eis potestatem filios de ifieri, his qui credunt in omini eus, qui non ex sanguinibus, neque ex voluntate carnis, neque ex voluntate virdis et ex deo nati sunt. Et verbum caro factum est, et habitavit in nobis, et vitimus gloriam eus, gloriam quasi unigenitia patre, plenum gratiae veritatis. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry for banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. Then after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. Let us pray, O God, our refuge and our strength, look down with favor upon thy people who cry to thee, and through the intercession of the glorious and immaculate Virgin Mary, Mother of God, of blessed Joseph, her spouse, of thy blessed apostles, Peter and Paul, and all the saints, do thou mercifully and graciously hear the prayers which we pour forth for the conversion of sinners, and for the freedom and exaltation of Holy Mother Church of the same Christ our Lord. St. Michael the Archangel, defend Amen. us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Most sacred heart of Jesus. Most sacred heart of Jesus, most sacred heart of Jesus, Mary assumed into heaven, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. <laughs> 